Greetings and salutations, my name is JW608, and today I am playing Star Maid. And I have a plan to figure out... Well, maybe not to figure out, but to help me figure out... Um, AI targeting. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to build me a spaceship. What? A spaceship in Star Maid? I know, preposterous, isn't it? So, what we're going to do is we're going to... Uh, no, we're gonna... I want to build a box. Actually, I want to build several boxes. And specifically, a box around the core. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five. All right, a five by five by five, but oh, actually, there's a ten in there somewhere. Anyway, irrelevant. We're gonna build a box. And then we're going to use some scaffolding. We're going to... Like that. Actually, we're going to do longer than that. We're going to do 30 out. But that's 20. I know there are already 10 there. Come on, 30. And... 30. Awesome. All right, so let's unset all of this. And now we are going to take our different systems. We're going to use thrusters. Power, except I don't want really want thrusters. Ah, thrusters will be fine. Power. So let's... Let's grab this and let's give it a... 5 by 5 by 5 doubled of thrusters. And let's give uh, power over here. Power. We'll use two types of power block. And let's see what other type of we uh, weapon. I want a weapon. Um, let's see. How about a cannon? Put the head over here. I mean, it shouldn't be able to shoot this. Actually, no, it can shoot it once. If I move it, everything's done for, but I can shoot. Huh. Because I have exactly the number. Okay, yeah, we're good. All right, and let's grab... I don't want shields. Actually, no, I want shield capacitors. Why not shield reactors? You know you need a shield reactor to make it work. Yes, but I don't want this vessel to be shielded. That's the whole point. I want, to get, I want it to get shot. Uh, let's grab some chambers. And, um, just a block of hull. Except I would like standard armor as well. There we go. So what on earth is all this nonsense you hear you ask? Well, I wanted things that are spaced out to see if, if, um, if the AI targets specific things or just kind of does so randomly, if you will. And I would like to bulk this up. When I look at it, it's, oh, it still thinks the, okay, that still thinks the center is there. Where is my... Center mass. Center mass is over there somewhere. I want it to be more up to the front. There we go. Center of mass is now up here. There we go. Center of mass is now clearly not at the core. In fact, I would like to mark the center of mass with something. How about some pink standard? And let's try over here as well. Let's undo that. And there we go. All right. Yeah, 
in there. That way I can see the center of mass in the ship, if you will. Even if you won't, I'll still be able to see vaguely where the center of mass is. Alright, we're going to call this, we're going to save it as a, um, um, testing target. I don't know. Alright, so it's a testing target. We have a whole bunch of armor. Center of mass is pulled away from the systems. In fact, let's hop in back into our camera. See the the little targety thing, the little diamond, is at center of mass. This is what I always assumed, but never really could prove. So does it shoot at center of mass? And I built this box around the core because I can't tell if the core takes damage by looking at the core because it doesn't do it like that. But I can see if any of them blocks are missing. So let's charge up our cloak drive because I don't want to be the target. I want that to be the target. And I'm invincible still. Come on, drive. There we go. Turn it on and hit the wrong button. Mass spawn, add MS01. It is a pirate. Yar. And here we go. Now, the idea is, ah, looks like it's hitting shields. Then it changes and shoots, shoots power. Now it's changed targets and it's shooting, shooting uh, the thrusters. Change targets back to the to the power. Okay. Where are we? Change targets back to shields. So it looks like as it orbits, it changes its its system target or it changes targets to different systems, at least looks like now. And I fried some weapons. So far it has not targeted the armor block. And it's overheating, so it's this one's dead in the water. So let's get rid of him and pop in a new one. I don't want the space chicken. Admin load. There we go. Come on, target it. You know you want to. There you go. And it looks like it hits systems. Huh. I went for the shield first again. I don't know if that's because if it was just closest to the shield. I think it was because it was just closest to the shield. Hmm. Then goes for the thrusters. It ignored the core from best I could tell. Okay, that's interesting. So it does look like it goes for systems, but there's a way to check this. We get rid of both of these entities. We hop out and we give us another one of these. Admin load. One of eight. And then we stop. And we uh, remove, replace, pick with camera. Ooh, 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 ooh. Replace with active slot. Let's go remove mode. There we go. This should actually only be like a five by five by five. No one cares. Pick with camera. Pick with camera. Pick with camera. And pick with camera. So all I have up there are those system blocks. All right, so now let's hop back into our camera ship. Fire up our camera. And then pull in another... Red ship of one, minus one. And it looks like it autumn, yep, it looks like it went for the systems, even though these blocks were closer. Let's see if it changes target. No, it doesn't, even though it's orbiting, it looks like it's targeting the systems. Hmm. 
So it, we know it targets systems. All right. Thank you very much, Mr. Ship. Thank you for your service. But you are no longer needed here. Um, we're going to do one more. F1, F8. No, don't fly, dummy. Uh, let's see. Let's go 5 by 5 by 5. Oh, clear that. Get rid of those. And get rid of those. And let's see. 10 by 10 by 10. Actually, I don't want a 10 by 10 by 10. Oh, yeah, let me do it. I do want a 10 by 10 by 10. I would like to cover these and, well, let's do by fives. Can it, can the AI cheat is what I want to know here. My guess is yes, it is cheating constantly. What do you mean by cheat? Can it see systems that are obscured? That is, can it see these? Will it change from the visible targets to the to the target that's behind five meters of armor? So it has two choices. Also, I'd like to know what it thinks about logic. So I'm very concerned about the uh, opinion of AI on large logic box. <laughs> No, um, I, well, I am very concerned about it. All right, so now let's do one more as we pull in. Come on, mass spot, add. Oh, not M and D, M and S. All right, and minus one, because it is a pirate. Instantly goes for the, the visible. It's going for the visible stuff first. All right. I've got some scaffolding there. That's because it was trying to hit the... Then, yep. Then it changes target to the invisible. I don't know. Is it... Is it running a scanner? Uh, it doesn't have a... Well, it would have whatever scanner I have in this, this ship here is what I'd be running. So it should not see, that should not come up, the power block should not come up if the scanner is accurate. So yes, it cheats. It cheats, it cheats bad. I have the same scanner in this ship as I do in that one. Nothing. Like, absolutely nothing. It shows me where these cannons are. Example, if I were to hit that ship, it would tell me where yeah, where weapon systems are, not where reactors are. So it cheats, because those are those are power blocks that I hit, are they not? <laughs> cool. So not only have we learned that uh yeah, it's not a tremendous shot, we learned that it cheats. It should not be able to tell what is in this clump of Clump of armor. This clump of armor should be identical to it, but it it knows that there's systems here. Huh. And it's ignoring the center of mass, so my initial hypothesis was incorrect. Well it was probably correct in the in the block or in the space chicken because it didn't have any systems. It was just a mass of blocks. So it looks like it's it really, really hates the power blocks. There we go. And it's it's eventually going to cut its way through. It's going to take it forever. No, it has. There has been a breach. Hmm. Well, that's nice to know that they cheat. Oh, oh, good. He's tried to diversify its diet. Also, it has not tried to snap onto this logic block. This looks like incidental damage from the, um, or collateral damage from trying to shoot the 
shields. So it doesn't think of logic as a system then. Hmm, interesting. I wonder if it pro I wonder if it thinks that has a higher priority, prioritizes it. Ah, logic turns blue when it's shot. I never noticed that. That's weird. I figured it would turn off when it was shot. Hmm. All right. So today we learned that the game cheats. Well, we already knew it cheated, but I didn't know it cheated that bad. I feel, I feel um, hurt. I don't know. Anyway. Why do you have so many beams? Usually, oh, because it's going to little, 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 little. So it was going to little, 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 little. It's rendering multiple beams. See, there should only be two, but it's going to little, 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 little. <laughs> Anywho, I have been JW608. This has been Star Maid, and I will do you cats later.